Um, today so we're going to talk about uh, something quite new. Uh, we in our program we never have uh, you know talking about uh, technology such as a uh, hybrid uh, solar system. All right. Um, normally when we talk about hybrid, uh, it's, it's normally it's a very expensive system for a hybrid uh, solar for for example wind and solar hybrid or solar and genset hybrid um, but today's uh, what we're going to talk about is actually is uh, solar and um, grid hybrid yeah so um, customers do ask um, they need uh, a solar pump yeah but they are worried that uh, if a solar pump that running for 24 hours uh, especially during the night you need to have a battery bank uh, to support uh, the night operations but of course these days people know that yes although solar panels price is going down but uh, battery price is solar especially solar batteries uh, is, is going up and furthermore um, solar battery is not so environment uh, friendly these days is because you uh, use a lot of uh, lead acid uh, kind of battery so that's why um, we want to have something that uh, really really green that means uh, that's it during the morning when the Sun is strong then you can use the uh, solar panel to power the pump all right but let's say is during the night uh, whereby no suns uh, but you still need to run your uh, water pump or your water features uh, then you will use the power from the grips for example the power from the TMB uh, to run it so in such a way uh, you can call this as a solar hybrid uh, pump. Today, uh, what I have with me is actually is a medium size. Uh, uh, we have been, you know, promoting or selling this pump for many many years already. Uh, all you have noticed is our medium size brushless uh, uh, fountain pump or uh, normal uh, under underwater thermos pump. All right, um, but uh, the technology is. Uh, nothing new. I mean, he's been around in, in the company and uh, you guys have used it uh, for a long time. It's a very reliable kind of brushless pump. Uh, but what is special today is we're going to talk about is really the hybrid. The hybrid technology actually is, is come from the, uh, the solar panel itself, alright? This, although you can see this is just like a 10 watt uh, solar panel, um, but what is different is this, this panel itself at the back there, uh, they have a hybrid system here, okay? Um, just give me a moment, I will probably explain to you, okay? Uh, in the letter. So, for example, um, this pump, okay, and this panel, uh, as, as you guys today know, is normally that you take the pump, uh, then you just plug into the solar panel, and when the sun comes out, uh, you know, the, the pump will, will start pumping, yeah? But sometimes, let's say it's very cloudy and you know, raining time, the pump is actually not working. It's because uh, not enough sunlight to push the pump. Yeah? But what we can do um, uh, uh, further is actually is, um, for example, you, you pop at the back. Yeah? All right? So what we can do uh, actually is um, to have a hybrid in the sand. Um, we want to use the uh, power from uh, TMB or from the grip. So what we, you can do is actually is you can use the power from the TMB, all right, the grip, all right, and uh, it come with the, uh, I would say that long enough wire, uh, you know, for, for you to do your uh, application, yeah, your, your pumping application. Uh, the power from the grip, actually this is uh, 24V, all right, uh, adapter basically is uh, from the grip or from the socket uh, you know when you plug in uh, this they will step up from 240 VAC uh, back to 24 uh, DC yeah so the power uh, 24 DC will go inside to the uh, adapter here all right then uh, we will have the solar uh, going uh, from, from here and then to the pump itself. Uh, of course, this this model uh, do come with uh, LED light, yeah. All right, LED light. Uh, of course, this LED light only work uh, during the uh, night. All right, but of course, it definitely will not tap the power from the solar, uh, but power from the uh, the grip, which is the from the AC uh, 24 uh, DC uh, adapter, yeah. All right. 
so this one you can plug in for your light all right so um very straightforward uh very easy to install okay of course uh as, as usual it comes with uh three different uh head so you can create uh all kind of water feature that you like all right um in a short while probably uh i will you know go outdoor and uh test uh this this pump um then i'll probably can show you more on uh, how the uh, hybrid uh, system use yeah so uh, you have the power from the grip all right tnb and the power from the solar all right but of course uh, when the sun is strong everything will using the solar so the power from the grip will cut off oh yeah but let's say um, it's cloudy the, the sun is not strong enough so you will take whatever power that you can generate from the solar and then add on uh, the power from the grid probably here will you know maybe here you can produce 50 here give you another 50 yeah but let's say come to come to the night totally no power no sun yeah uh, from the solar then 100% you can you know draw the power uh, from the TMD grip or from our grip yeah so uh, in a short while I'll show you some uh, line demonstration I have set up the uh, hybrid solar pump, okay, and a uh, very small container. And uh, as you can see now, uh, I have the solar panel on top, all right. And I also connected to the grid, all right, uh, with the energy meter, all right. Okay, so right now it's actually using the hybrid. Uh, is consumed about 4.5 watt from the TMB, which is from the grid, and then uh, the remaining is actually from the solar. Okay, so let's do an experiment here. Uh, let's say if I cover the panel, all right, just don't let any sunlight to come in, all right, no sunlight, okay, and you can see actually, let's say using the power from the grid and you can see the energy meter actually is consumed roughly about 9.6 watt which is equivalent to 10 watt so right now let's say imagine no power uh, you know from the sun or from the solar panel this pump itself is actually consuming roughly about 10 watt yeah so 9.6 yeah all right so it's fully from the grid all right or in other words tmb yeah so let's say uh let's turn over the panel let the power of the sun all right come in which is in other words uh, solar power as well as hybrid yeah right now the sun uh, in the late afternoon is not really really strong but let's see how much it affects to the uh you know from the energy of the grid okay right now you can see uh, 3.6 watt is used uh, from the grid power from the grid and then this roughly about 6 watt yeah so a 10 watt panel 10 watt panel actually give up roughly about uh, 6 watt uh, but still not strong enough uh, to give a full power uh, to the pump all right to the pump uh, here so that's why it still require uh, roughly about 3.8 watt uh, you know from here okay what i can do right now is actually i also can unplug let's say the power from the adapter which is from the grid or from tmd let's me unplug it then you can see the energy meter become zero all right and then right now it's 100 percent uh from the solar all right 100 percent from the solar but as you can see uh the water 
uh, which is the pump pumping, is a bit weak compared to just now. Just now it was maximum, yeah, pumping maximum, yeah. All right, so you know, a bit weak right now. Just purely on the sun, yeah. But let's say uh, if I plug back the energy meter, then you can see now running um, at the maximum, yeah. Okay. Maximum power, and right now it's roughly the grid is provide about 3.2 watt. All right, now it's about 3 watts, and then the panel providing about the remaining 7 watt. Yeah, so this is how the hybrid system works. Okay, it's either take the power from the grid or power from the sun. Yeah, push wherever. Yeah, so let's say the sun is strong. You are maximizing using the power from the sun, yeah. But let's say the sun is weak, getting cloudy, uh, then they will tap the power from the grid, yeah. So this is how the hybrid system works, all right. So this hybrid system actually is uh, running on a 24 VDC. Uh, it's a low voltage kind of uh, solar system and solar pump. Uh, compared to the uh, 240 VAC uh, normal uh, pump. This is much much safer. This, this is because uh, this is low voltage, yeah. So it will, it will not easily kill you, all right. Compared to the uh, 240 VAC, uh, that kind of pump, yeah, electric shock and things like that. Uh, because this is low voltage, uh, this is very good. And for those customers who actually uh, you know doing aquaponic or hydroponic. Um, you need to run your pump for 24 hours and uh, you're always concerned on your energy cost. Uh, I would say that this is a solution for you, yeah? So let's say there is the sun, it's strong, then the sun will power it, alright? But let's say the sun is not so strong, but you can subsidize by using the good power, yeah? So in other words, you really really using this as a green energy and uh, you know, no battery involved, okay? And it will give you the maximum power, all right? And, you know, some sort of force saving yeah, in the system, yeah? So either it's from the sun or from the grid, all right? Thanks for uh, watching uh, our YouTube channel.